In today's infrastructures, ensuring a secure, compliant infrastructure without application disruption is absolutely paramount. But in the past, upgrades that were used to install new features or pinpoint patch individual issues were often disruptive. So let's go ahead and see how Intersight separates the management features and the infrastructure hardware while utilizing redundant fabrics to allow for a non-disruptive upgrade. Let's first start by talking about the different methods to downloading and installing firmware. The SAS dashboard allows us to update firmware easily through a web interface simply by selecting the fabric interconnect and selecting what upgrade path we want to take. The CVA and PVA though allow us to manually download that firmware at any time and then push it to our device. All three of these solutions have the ability to separate firmware upgrades from individual feature updates. Now, when kicking off firmware updates, the system will update the fabric interconnects and the intelligent fabric modules in the chassis while utilizing that redundant fabric for failover and resiliency. To show this, let's go ahead and connect to the fabric interconnects. Now, once connected to the fabric interconnects, what we'll notice here is our firmware version. It looks like we're on a 9.35. And so if we want to do an upgrade, all we're going to have to do is go here to Actions and then say Upgrade Firmware. Now, as we click Next Through, we also want to mention that Cisco does provide a recommended version of the firmware in the event that you're unsure of what firmware version you should be on. And check this out. Once we select it and we click Next, it is as simple as now doing a pre-initial check to ensure that the system is compatible with the firmware update and then clicking upgrade. Now please keep in mind that once you do kick off that firmware upgrade, another thing that we have is first of all, before we move over and update the secondary fabric interconnect, we are going to do a mid upgrade health check before failing over to the second FI and also keep in mind that we're still evacuating the fabric to ensure proper failover. That leaves us with a simple, easy to use, easy to upgrade method where almost the entire firmware update process is automated for you. This ensures that the fabric is secure and healthy and provides you with a better peace of mind at the end of the day.